June 28, 2006 is a day that will go down in sports history, a day that changed the UFC forever. Undefeated in the UFC at 5-0, brawler Chris Lieben entered the cage at UFC Fight Night 5. Across from him, Octagon newcomer and relatively unknown to the US, Anderson the Spider Silva. Anderson had an MMA career with 17 wins and 4 losses at the time and was starting to get more underground buzz as being one of the most lethal strikers after obliterating Lee Murray, Jorge Rivera and Tony Fricklin, earning him the Cage Rage middleweight belt. Because of this, Anderson was a slight betting line favorite to leave in. Well, the bell rung, 49 seconds passed and Chris Lieben was lying on the ground in a daze. Anderson landed 17 of his 20 strikes, two knockdowns, and capped it off with a brutal knee to the head before finishing the crippler with some ground strikes. Lieben managed to throw eight punches. He landed only one of them, and it had absolutely no effect. Anderson's next fight crowned him the UFC middleweight champion. This was just the beginning for Anderson's nearly invincible title reign. If you haven't watched this fight in years, and you're recovering from UFC 168, I recommend you go back and watch the fight that started the most dominant, accomplished, entertaining, and even enigmatic and polarizing career in MMA history. I'm Mike Turpin, and this has been an MMA insert, welcoming the spider.